Hi and welcome to the session. Today we will learn about area of a parallelogram. Area of a parallelogram is equal to base into height. Now here we have a parallelogram A, B, C, D. So in this parallelogram we can take any of the sides as the base. Suppose we take side AB as the base. Then the perpendicular drawn from the opposite vertex that is from D to AB will be the height of the parallelogram corresponding to the base AB. So here DE is the height corresponding to the base AB. And thus the area of this parallelogram will be base AB into height DE. Let's take an example for this. We are given that area of a parallelogram is equal to 60 centimeters square and its base is 15 centimeters. And we need to find the height of the parallelogram. Now we know that area of the parallelogram is equal to base into height. So 60 centimeters square will be equal to base that is 15 centimeters into height. So from this we get height equal to 60 upon 15 centimeters which will be equal to 4 centimeters. Now our next topic is area of a triangle. Area of a triangle is equal to half into base into height. Here in triangle ABC, if we take BC as the base of the triangle, then its height will be the perpendicular drawn from the opposite vertex, that is from vertex A to the base BC. So here AD is the height corresponding to the base BC. Now in a triangle also, we can take any of the sides as the base of the triangle. Thus here the area of triangle ABC will be given by half into base BC into its corresponding height AD. Let's take an example for this. Suppose we are given that area of a triangle is equal to 224 meters square and the height of the triangle is equal to 16 meters. So we need to find the length of the base of the triangle. We already know that area of the triangle is half into base into height. So from this we have 224 meters square will be equal to half into base into height that is 16 meters. So this implies base will be equal to 224 into 2 upon 16 meters which will be equal to 28 meters. Thus the length of the base of the triangle is 28 meters. Now let's see an important fact regarding the area of the triangles. We know that congruent triangles are always equal in area. Here we have three triangles which are on same base AB and their heights are also equal. So that means these three triangles are equal in area. But we can see this clearly that these three triangles are not congruent to each other. So that means triangles which are congruent to each other will be equal in area. But it is not necessary that the triangles which are equal in area will be congruent. So we have all the congruent triangles are equal in area but the triangles 
equal in area need not be congruent. Thus, in this session, we have learnt about area of parallelogram and area of a triangle. With this, we finish this session. Hope you must have understood all the concepts. Goodbye, take care and have a nice day.